Na een valse start in de Eredivisie tegen Feyenoord wil Vitesse zichzelf revancheren in speelronde 2 tegen Excelsior. We spreken Sondre Tronstad en Thomas Dletz over het uitduel met de Rotterdammers dat komende vrijdag om 8 uur wordt afgetrapt in het Van Dongen en de Roos stadion. Thomas, it was a false start for us uh, in the Eredivisie back uh, on Sunday. Uh, how do you look back on that game? Yeah, we have to look back to two different things. The one thing is the result and if you start with a with a losing game it's never good. Uh, on the other hand, we also have to look for the performance and I think we, we did really well. Uh, we were ready for the game. Uh, the beginning of the game was really good. We were totally good in the game. And also the beginning of the second half, we came back with a 2-2, but then uh, within five minutes we gave the game away. Uh, it was two easy falls and, and, and this is finally uh, one <coughs> yeah, long story short. Uh, if you make mistakes like this and concede too much goals, uh, then it's difficult to win games. But I think um, we, we have to improve, we have to learn out of these mistakes and have to go on with the things uh, which went really well. Uh, because now at Excelsior it's a really tough game. Um, you know, if a team promotes first home game, uh, sold out stadium, small stadium, it's something uh, special and Definitely, it will be a totally different game than against uh, Feyenoord. We dropped a little bit down after the 2-2, and then uh, they got a, you can say, a little bit lucky goal, but also a little bit quality. And uh, we can also look back and uh, and see how we can defend better. Um, and then in the end, they scored oh, two more goals, and then the game was finished. Last season, you've played the most minutes uh, of the entire squad. How are you feeling at the moment? I feel great. I feel motivated and ready uh, to go again. Of course, we want to uh, have a revenge after the after the last game and uh, go tomorrow for 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 the three points. And how is the spirit in the team? No, it's great. I think it's really as uh, as you, when you lose a game in the beginning, uh, it's first uh, few days is always like a little bit shit. That's how it is. But uh, eventually, when you're getting closer to the to the next game, I think people are ready to go again. And how will you uh, prepare for that? First of all, we, we thought about uh, training on artificial, but uh, it's a clear message from team side that they don't want to do this. And I think uh, you cannot prepare exactly for that because our artificial is different than the artificial over there. Um, and you, you have to know, <coughs> and everybody knows how it is, uh, if, a, if a team plays their first matches at home uh, in, the, in the Eredivisie. So they will be full on fire, but it's up to us. We know that from, uh, if you look at our players from the squad, we are the better team, but we have to focus 100% and we have to do it 90 minutes, not only 60 minutes like in the last game. I think then we, we are the better team and then uh, we have to win this game. You will be supported by a full away end tomorrow. How do you feel about that? We need support from the from the fans, and uh, hopefully they will make uh, a lot of sound and uh, make a good atmosphere at the stadium. And, uh, and then we, it's up to us to to uh, produce on the pitch. Yeah, it's always nice uh, if you if you have a, a good atmosphere. Uh, I like the games in the evening, Friday evening game. It's it's perfect, and then with a full stadium, hopefully with also a lot of guys uh, from Arnhem, uh, this is always nice. Schubert is still injured. How is the fitness of the rest of the team? Uh, the rest is fine. Miljano Jonathan's uh, still some problems. We will make a diagnostic right now to have a closer look what's going on with him. The rest is fit.